Good morning, everybody. It's officially been one week since we started our cruising adventures. We are in Pentwater. Show everybody. It's pretty gloomy today and windy. There's that. And what are we doing today, Taylor? Laundry. It's laundry day. There's a laundry mat literally right on the corner. You can see it from here almost. Right on the corner right there. So we'll bring the dinghy over and do some laundry and see what else the day brings today. today. Tay, it's your birthday. What'd we do today so far? Well, we went and worked out ashore and then we came back and bathed. And then we went back and did some window shopping. Had a Bloody Mary. We did and it was very good. And now we're thinking of going on a dinghy ride around the little lake. Yes, we're gonna get our swimsuits on. Hopefully go for a little swim. It's like 77 out, sun's out, it's beautiful. A little warm in the boat, so getting out and swimming will be good. And then I think tonight we're gonna go out for dinner for his birthday. Happy birthday, I love you. Yay, love you. We finished the night with dinner and some music by the beach. The next day we made the short trip from Pentwater, Michigan to Ludington, Michigan. It was only about 10 nautical miles. We made it to Ludington. We enjoyed a quick trip to the beach, got back to the boat, enjoyed the sunset before some heavy winds came through that night. Today's a big grocery haul day, so we are transporting our bikes to shore, hauling our dinghy, and then we are going to Aldi, Lowe's, and AT&T, and Walmart. So we have a lot on our to-do today. It's about 3.30, so it'll be a long day, but it'll be nice to be able to get all that done. So we'll check in later an adventure to get here but we made it to Lowe's our first stop well second so oh, it's gonna die. Taylor's got all the groceries he's gonna leave me here at the dock while he brings it to the boat door Right over there, it's a nice little beach next to where we're anchored here in Ludington. And what did we do today in Ludington? Today we got my bike fixed. Yes, his pe pedal broke on it. So. And my pedal snapped on the way to get groceries. Yep. But luckily we made it most of the way before that happened. And I was actually able to limp the bike on one pedal. It was a very interesting sight. Yeah. Yeah, what uh, else did we had a oh we went to a brewery today? We went to the brewery. I had a couple Scottish beers. Yeah. Dark as coffee. And Emma had a couple light beers. As always. And they didn't have pizza there. Nope. And Taylor wanted pizza because he's deprived. I'm deprived of pizza. So we went to an Italian joint and waited about an hour and fifteen minutes for pizza. That was ridiculous. But it's our usual when we go out to eat. Yeah, whenever we go out to eat, we always get bad service. I don't know why. It doesn't matter where we go. So. so we're getting out before we have to buckle down and get to the boat tonight before some bad storms come through. Yeah, you can see it coming in here. It's going to be bad. How high are the winds going to be, Emma? It says around 75 miles per hour. Up to 75 mile per hour gusts. So we'll see if that's actually going to be true. Yeah. Regardless, we're getting prepared. I mean, we're just going to be on the boat. <laughs> yeah. So we'll try to get some footage of that when the when the wind comes. 
but we'll see because it might be in the middle of the night. We'll get some. Beach. All right, that's all for now. Bye bye. We went for a walk, which we thought was going to be before the rain came. <laughs> Badger is a car ferry and passenger ferry that runs between Ludington and Manitowoc. It's the last coal-fired steamship in the United States. The next day, we went to land and adventured through some of the town that we haven't seen. Taylor making dinner tonight with his Italian music and our Italian wine. I thought you were taking a picture, so I was standing still. <laughs> I, was I, was like, oh, I, I was wondering why you were looking like that. <laughs> so today is our last day in Ludington, Michigan. Um, we're just kind of doing some exploring. We went to breakfast this morning at a little cafe. Um, we went to an antique store to try to find an oil lamp for our anchor light. No success there. Um, what are we up to next? Uh, we're going to the museum. Oh yeah, Maritime the Museum. Maritime Museum. Maritime Museum. We have to look at the rest of the sculptures along yeah. this little walk area. Yeah, there's some sculptures down here, so stay tuned. We said goodbye to Ludington and set sail for Nakama the next morning. So we are about a little less than nine miles out now. Um, we It is a rough sail. <laughs> Leave it that way. So it's not so much that the wind picked up. Um, there was a northern wind the last few days and then today it's coming out of the south and so there's a lot of slop out there. Um, and the waves just have no clue what they're doing. Um, and so we're just dealing with that while sailing downwind. And so it's pretty rough. Um, Taylor's steering right now. Our autopilot does not keep up with downwind sailing like this, especially with these waves. Um, and so I sailed for about two hours and also Taylor's sailing, but we should be there within the next like hour and a half. Hopefully if we keep the speed, we're wait running wing on wing. Um, Taylor's really focusing out here. It's the only thing we can do and listening to his music, which helps him focus. But fine by me. It's a little rough. We'll check in later. Currently right there at this little guy and we are traveling to Portage Lake here. Um, we just passed Manistee right here. Oops. 
We just passed Manistee. There's not a lot there. We didn't, we've stopped there once before in the past, so we didn't really feel like stopping there again. We've never been to Onakama, which is right here. Um, we considered stopping here for a moment just because of how crazy the waves are, but we're just gonna keep going. We have about seven miles, seven, oh, come on, iPad. We have about seven and a half miles left. Um, we started right here. So we started at Pia Marquette Lake, made around the point here, worked our way up, and then that's our little blurb we have left. So again, they should be there probably about an hour, hour and a half. Um, so it's coming out of the south, southwest today. That's correct. And we're heading north. <laughs> um, and so our speed is varied just because we're surfing a lot of waves. And so when we're surfing a wave, we're probably going about seven knots. And then when we're in troughs, we're probably going about between four and five knots. So it's super varied, averaging between five and six knots, I would say. Um, sometimes it slows us down to like four knots, but it really depends. And then wind speed, it's coming about 12 knots, um, like I said, out of the south. But it is gusting up to like 20 knots ish um and so again the wind itself is manageable it's i mean we're grateful we have wind otherwise it'd be really rough out here not being able to keep up with these waves um they're just not doing anything that's predictable at all and that's typically how lake michigan is it doesn't have a lot of predictability so that's that for wind today it's about 4 30 p.m we made it here about an hour and a half ago we anchored in the boat um i tried taking a nap but that never goes well so and taylor's just hanging out out there so it is our first like official day and not onakama what's it called onakama onakama we've been saying it wrong it's yeah we've just, been saying it wrong it's typically what we do because there's an e after the o and the n yeah. But it's pronounced Onakama. Yeah. Well, there's not much to this town. There is a uh, springs that we're actually at right now. So we're adventuring that. Of course, we have laundry going because for some reason we always have a ton of laundry. Always a load of laundry to do. <laughs> so there's a laundromat nearby. So we don't know if we're going to hang out here tomorrow or not or if we're going to start sailing a little more north. But we'll see what the rest of the day brings. Bye. one of the springs we're gonna go adventure for some more Let's just drop my phone. we got our water we filled up a jug too that's there and our water bottles that's good it's really tasty it's super cold that's all for now like share and subscribe if you'd like to see more